Glory be to God in the highest. You are welcome to salvation now. Today we'll be looking at the image of God, the express image of God. Uh, many times people have have a different ideas of what God looked like. And right from creation, people have this uh, had desire to know more about God and they try to reach him in diverse way, in different way. And uh, in Hebrews chapter 1, verse 1, the Bible says, God would at sundry time and in diverse manner speak in time past unto the Father by the prophets, as in these last days spoken unto us by his Son, who is express image of his person. Hallelujah. This shows that in this last day, if you want to know more about God, then you need to know more about Christ. Jesus Christ is the express image of the invisible God. No man has ever seen before, before and no man can tell us who God is like Jesus Christ. No spiritual leaders that have ever lived or that are living now uh, that can tell us the image, the character, the life, and the wisdom of God, and also to show us the power of God. No one can do it like our Lord Jesus Christ. Because the Bible said in the book of Colossians, chapter 1, verse 15, the Bible says, He is the image of the invisible God. Everything we need to know about God is in Christ Jesus. Everything we need to know about God is in Christ Jesus Christ. So in Colossians chapter 2, verse 9, the Bible said that for in him, that is in Christ, dwelleth all the fullness of God the Father. Everything about God is in Christ Jesus. So the character of God, the life of God, the nature of God, the glory of God, everything is embedded in Christ Jesus. So nobody can tell us who God is or nobody can reveal God to us like our Lord Jesus Christ. And that is why many people in the olden times and also in this present time, they want to know more about God. They don't want to know the mind of God, but they fail because they have different ways of, uh, of, of knowing God. And also in the Old Testament, the Bible let us know that God has spoken to our fathers through the prophet, by signs, by things of nature and all the stuff. But in this last day, he is speaking to us by his son, Jesus Christ. This shows to us that if there's anybody we need to listen to, is our Lord Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ is, the, is God in person because he has come to reveal God to us. And that is why he told his disciples when he asked him that they should show them the Father, that is the God. He said, you have been with me for this far, but you have not known that you have not known me because I'm representing God. Say, so anybody that has seen me, I've seen the Father. So I'm inviting you today to come to the Lord Jesus Christ. You want to know more about God, you know, want to know about His nature, about His mind, then Jesus Christ is the one that will reveal to you. Then that means you need to have a relationship with Christ by giving your life to Him, by accepting Him as your Lord. And personal savior and you will know the mind of god for your life and it shall be well with you in jesus name so accept him today and it shall be well he will reveal god to you and you will not miss it in jesus name god bless you